All right, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, all appropriate ages. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you may be. Hope you're staying safe and healthy indoors. Oh, uh, Lloyd Notak. I'm in the Necrolis Captura scene. This is mainly for people that don't follow any of the devs from Digital Extremes or Digital Extremes or Warframe on Twitter, and because it wasn't also in the activity feed in the Orbiter. Uh, but they released, I came home from work last night and saw that there was an update on the upcoming updates. So this is an update on updates. And I'm just not gonna go over the whole thing, I'm just gonna go over some of the major points. Where Rebecca said we still have quite a bit planned for October, even if city block power outages prevent us from hitting those plans on the exact dates because working from home wasn't hard enough as is. So it seems where they're based, they're having power outages, which fucking, I know that sucks. The amount of times that this little village here has had power outages and you've just gone for like hell, even last year. This time last year we had a water. Uh, one of the pipes, or one of the mains burst near us and we went without running water for say it was eight, nine days, something like that. Shit like that sucks, so I get that. Anyway, off topic there. Anyway, the first big one, where is a glass maker? Now I need to read this one in its entirety. All platforms are waiting for the finale and it's coming. Brackets, hold the eye rolls. End brackets. As with all things Nightwave this year, it's taken a while. We know it. Nora knows we know it. We'll have the finale out soon. It will last long enough to give as many 10 hour chance to play it in the context of the season. Then we'll work our way towards the next steps for Nightwave. As always, we will give you at least two weeks head up before we end series three of Glassmaker. We are still planning on launching episode five in October. If that changes, we'll let you know. So we've got eight other than today, after today I should say, we've got eight more days left of October. So Nightwave could drop anywhere between Saturday this week and Saturday next week. Because Sunday will be the 1st of November. And then after that, whenever the finale drops, Hmm, who knows. That probably won't be till end of October, maybe? December, maybe, at a push? Then there's Neja Prime, uh, which will drop on the 27th of October. So that's Tuesday next week. But the problem with that is, over here in the UK, whenever they've dropped a Prime Access or released a Prime Frame, they say it drops on that day, but the majority of the time over here, it's dropped like midnight. So we don't usually get it till the Wednesday. So hold with bated breath. And this is one that I find laughable. Tenno Gen Round 19 Part 1 on consoles. We'd like to verify that we intend to deliver all of Round 19 Part 1 to consoles pending agreements. Stay tuned for launch date details. Yeah, I'm not buying that for a second because there's not been a single round of Tenogen that's come with all of the Tenogen parts. You could go back and look at what's been missing from PC, uh, from console compared to what PC got. All the way back to Tenogen round one. And what else is there? This is a tricky one on the next dev stream because we have a few surprises still in store, but ultimately we are in the work before we show some more stage on some anticipated content such as Damus Arcana, Lavos, Corpus Queen Pins, Warframe revisions overall. We have done several from home dev streams and do plan on continuing with them as it's a time we get to connect with everyone in the community in as close to like normal circumstances as possible. We are targeting early November for our next dev stream. Uh, yada, yada, yada. Yeah, and then there's more talk on QTCC. 
uh, where we've hit the $75,000 campaign goal and have three new stretch goals for our quest to conquer cancer this October. So the three new stretch goals are 80,000 will uh, give out the Conqueror sigil. 90,000 is the Zephyr Deluxe accessory concept art reveal. And 100,000 is the fashion frame videos of the next Warframe Lavos. Oh. General th week 32 notes. It's nearing the end of our 32nd week of work from home. In these weeks, 32 weeks of working from home? Fuck, it's been that long. Jesus. Oof. In these weeks, we've accomplished more than any of us expected from a bumpy Scarlet Spear that received tireless fixes and improvements, but was still pretty broken. To Deadlock Protocol, which actually worked pretty damn fucking well. I never had a problem with Deadlock Protocol. From a digital Tenocon to a simultaneous release of Heart of Deimos less than two months ago, we truly have no idea what, when to expect business as usual to return. Honestly, I wouldn't be surprised if fucking the PlayStation 5 and the Xbox Series X were secretly Transformers with the way things are going this year. There's no real indication yet, and our safety is our priority, as it should be with everyone, yet I still see people in the public acting so stupidly and so ignorant of others. Just because they and their family haven't been affected doesn't mean they shouldn't take precautions. Everyone should take precautions. Digital extremes are. Everyone fucking should, because you don't know who else you could be affecting in the process. <coughs> We're getting more and more support to make this remote thing work, but honestly, Tenno, it's tough. We're doing our best and identifying what works and what doesn't. Thank you for sticking around as we figure that out. Simply put, busy times ahead. Stay safe, everyone. So yeah, that was the update on updates. And as I said, this is for people that don't follow them on Twitter or don't look at the forums. See, oh, I wish you could talk to everyone in the Necrolisk. Why are you everywhere? So yeah. So within the next eight days, we'll have episode five of the Glassmaker. Then after that, we will get two weeks notice for whenever they put out, I did that by accident, put out the season finale. Oh, you can go in here in the capture scene. All right, that's sweet. Can you read these in capture? Nope. Damn it. Anywho, enough dicking around. I have to get ready for work. Uh, thanks for watching. Hope you found some of it useful. And I shall see all of you later.